I won't lock Dar Salaam, President Magufuli says as Tanzania cases rise to 284. Tanzanian President John Magufuli on Wednesday ruled out a lockdown of business capital Dar Salaam amid the COVID-19 pandemic, saying the move was aimed at saving people from difficulties and saving the country from an economic meltdown. There are those who have suggested that we lock down Dar Salaam. This is not possible, he said yesterday. Dar Salaam is the only center where we collect almost 80% of the country's revenue. We can continue taking all measures to curb the virus but not by locking down Dar Salaam, he added. The president was addressing a joint meeting of heads of defense and security in his hometown Chato where he touched on several issues, chief among them the fight against COVID-19. The country's virus cases rose by 30 to reach a total of 284. According to the president, there are several people who have recovered, almost 100, but very few have since been declared officially. Let's give people facts about the viral disease. We should stop giving information that creates panic among members of the public, said the head of state. He urged the heads of defense and security organs to take punitive actions against people, including politicians, who were spreading false information on COVID-19. In another development, the president appointed his personal advisor for health issues, Mabula Dadim Jembe, the new permanent secretary in the Ministry of Health. The appointment in the health docket was termed as reinforcing the government's resolve to fight the COVID-19 pandemic. Megafuli also appointed Abel Makubi the country's new chief medical officer, replacing Mohamed Bakari Kami who has retired. At the same time, Confirmed cases of COVID-19 in Tanzania climbed from 254 to 284 after 30 new cases were announced on Wednesday. Umi Mwalimu, the Minister of Health, Community Development, Gender, Elderly and Children, said in her official Twitter that 10 of the 30 new cases were from Dar's Salaam.